Today on Nostalgia Hit, we journey back in time to the 1970s, reminiscing about the much-beloved television actresses of that era. We'll shine a spotlight on the stars who graced our screens, portraying unforgettable characters in some of the biggest shows. We'll fast-forward to the present and discover where these talented actresses are now, looking at their most recent or final screen appearance. Angie Dickinson played Sergeant Suzanne Pepper Anderson. In 1974, Dickinson was 43 years old. She was born on September 30, 1931, and is now 92 years of age. Dickinson played Sergeant Suzanne Pepper Anderson in 90 episodes of the crime drama TV series Police Woman between 1974 and 1978. Her final screen role was in the 2009 drama TV movie Mending Fences, where she played Ruth Hansen. Aaron Gray played Colonel Wilma Deering. In 1979, Gray was 29 years old. She was born on January 7, 1950, and is now 74 years of age. Gray played Colonel Wilma Deering in 32 episodes of the sci-fi adventure TV series Buck Rogers in the 25th century between 1979 and 1981. Her most recent role was in the 2022 TV movie Mystery, It's Beginning to Look a Lot Like Murder, where she played Brianna. Shirley Jones played Shirley Partridge. In 1970, Jones was 36 years old. She was born on March 31, 1934, and is now 89 years of age. Jones played Shirley Partridge in 96 episodes of the musical sitcom The Partridge Family between 1970 and 1974. Her most recent role was in the 2021 Western film Forgiven This Gun for Hire, where she played a hotel owner. Lonnie Anderson played Jennifer Marlowe. In 1978, Anderson was 33 years old. She was born on August 5, 1945, and is now 78 years of age. Anderson played Jennifer Marlowe in 89 episodes of the TV sitcom WKRP in Cincinnati between 1978 and 1982. Her most recent role was in the 2023 festive comedy TV movie Ladies of the 80s, A Diva's Christmas, where she played Lily Marlowe. Mary Tyler Moore played Mary Richards. In 1970, Moore was 34 years old. She was born on December 29, 1936. She died from complications of pneumonia. On January 25, 2017, she was 80 years of age. Moore played Mary Richards in 168 episodes of the TV sitcom The Mary Tyler Moore Show between 1970 and 1977. Her final screen appearance was in a 2013 episode of the comedy TV show Hot in Cleveland where she played Diane. Marla Gibbs played Florence Johnston. In 1975, Gibbs was 44 years old. She was born on June 14, 1931, and is now 92 years of age. Gibbs played Florence Johnston in 217 episodes of the TV sitcom The Jeffersons between 1975 and 1985. At the age of 92, Gibbs shows no signs of slowing down, with recent appearances in numerous film and TV roles, including The Ms. Pat Show, History of the World Part 2, and A Snowy Day in Oakland. Please remember to give the video a like, and let us know your answer to the question at the end. Lindsay Wagner played Jamie Somers, the bionic woman. In 1976, Wagner was 27 years old. She was born on June 22, 1949, and is now 74 years of age. Wagner played Jamie Somers in 58 episodes of the sci-fi action-adventure television series The Bionic Woman between 1976 and 1978. Her most recent screen appearance was as a mystery celebrity in a 2023 episode of the game show Generation Gap titled The Six Million Dollar Woman. Adrienne Barbeau played Carol Trainer. In 1972, Barbeau was 27 years old. She was born on June 11, 1945, and is now 78 years of age. Barbeau played Carol Trainer in 126 episodes of the TV sitcom Maud between 1972 and 1978. Her most recent role was in the 2023 Amazon Prime mystery drama series Harlan Coben's Shelter, where she played Ellen Bolliter. Catherine Damon played Mary Campbell. In 1977, Damon was 47 years old. She was born on September 11, 1930. She died from cancer on May 4, 1987. 
She was 56 years of age. Damon played Mary Campbell in 83 episodes of the TV sitcom Soap between 1977 and 1981. Her final screen role was as Gail Bainbridge in the rom-com movie She's Having a Baby, which was released posthumously in 1988. Loretta Swit played Major Margaret Hot Lips Houlihan. In 1972, Swit was 35 years old. She was born on November 4, 1937, and is now 86 years of age. Swit played Major Margaret Hot Lips Houlihan in 251 episodes of the war comedy drama television series, MASH, between 1972 and 1983. Her most recent role was in the 2019 drama film, Play the Flute, where she played Mrs. Kincaid. Louise Lasser played Mary Hartman. In 1976, Lasser was 37 years old. She was born on April 11, 1939, and is now 84 years of age. Lasser played Mary Hartman in 325 episodes of the daily satirical soap opera Mary Hartman Mary Hartman between 1976 and 1977. Her most recent role was in the 2022 coming-of-age black comedy film Funny Pages where she played Linda the Pharmacy Lady. Valerie Harper played Rhoda Morgan Stern Gerard. In 1974, Harper was 35 years old. She was born on August 22, 1939. She died on August 30, 2019, following a long battle with cancer. She was 80 years of age. Harper played Rhoda Morgan Stern Gerard in 109 episodes of the TV sitcom Rhoda between 1974 and 1978. Her last screen appearance was in a 2018 episode of the comedy TV series Liza On Demand where she played Wanda. Karen Grassley played Caroline Ingalls. In 1974, Grassley was 32 years old. She was born on February 25, 1942, and is now 81 years of age. Grassley played Caroline Ingalls in 182 episodes of the Western historical drama TV series Little House on the Prairie between 1974 and 1982. Her most recent role was in the 2021 drama film Not to Forget, where she played Melody. Kate Jackson played Sabrina Duncan. In 1976, Jackson was 28 years old. She was born on October 29, 1948, and is now 75 years of age. Jackson played Sabrina Duncan in 69 episodes of the crime drama TV series Charlie's Angels between 1976 and 1979. Her last on-screen role was in a 2007 episode of the crime drama mystery TV series Criminal Minds, where she played Ambassador Elizabeth Prentice. Johnny Dubois played Wilona Woods. In 1974, Dubois was 42 years old. She was born on August 5, 1932. She died from a cardiac arrest. On February 17, 2020, she was 87 years of age. Dubois played Wilona Woods in 133 episodes of the TV sitcom Good Times between 1974 and 1979. Her final screen role was in the 2016 comedy film She's Got a Plan, where she played Betty Angela. Linda Carter played Wonder Woman. In 1975, Carter was 24 years old. She was born on July 24, 1951, and is now 72 years of age. Carter played Diana Prince in 60 episodes of the female superhero television series Wonder Woman from 1975 to 1979. Her most recent role was in the 2021 crime drama film, The Cleaner, where she played Carlene Briggs. Linda Lavin played Alice Hyatt. In 1976, Lavin was 39 years old. She was born on October 15, 1937, and is now 86 years of age. Lavin played Alice Hyatt in 202 episodes of the TV sitcom Alice between 1976 and 1985. Her most recent TV role was a voice part in the animated sitcom Bob's Burgers, where she voiced Gertie in a 2023 episode titled Radio, No You Didn't. Marin Jensen played Lieutenant Athena. In 1978, Jensen was 22 years old. She was born on September 23, 1956, and is now 67 years of age. Jensen played Lieutenant Athena in 21 episodes of the sci-fi TV series Battlestar Galactica between 1978 and 1979. 
Her last screen appearance was in a 1985 music video for the Don Henley single, Not Enough Love in the World. She quit acting to become the co-founder of Stila Cosmetics and presently founder of Glow Beauty Fuel. Penny Marshall played Laverne de Fazio. In 1976, Marshall was 33 years old. She was born on October 15, 1943. She died from complications of diabetes. On December 17, 2018, she was 75 years of age. Marshall played Laverne de Fazio in 178 episodes of the TV sitcom Laverne and Shirley between 1976 and 1983. Her final screen role was in a 2016 episode of the TV sitcom The Odd Couple where she played Patty Dombrowski. Lauren Tweez played Cruise director Julie McCoy. In 1977, Tweez was 24 years old. She was born on October 26, 1953, and is now 70 years of age. Tweez played Cruise director Julie McCoy in 199 episodes of the romantic comedy drama TV series The Love Boat between 1977 and 1987. Her most recent role was the 2021 biographical comedy drama film Potato Dreams of America, where she played Nina Ivanovna. Who were your favorite stars of television? And what were your favorite TV shows from the 1960s through to the 1990s that you'd like to see featured in future videos? Let us know in the comments below. Thanks for watching part 2 of famous stars from the biggest TV shows of decades past. We'll be adding lots more videos to this list in the coming weeks and months, so please be sure to subscribe and hit the like button if you enjoyed the video. Until next time.